Good morning, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Genevieve here again. Today is March the 7th, 2019, and it's a Thursday. And I just wanted to get on here and just uh, just do a little bit of praise and worship. And, um, and you're welcome to join me for 15 or 20 minutes. And I'm just really going to lift up the name of our King and give him all the glory, the honor and praise that he deserves. And, um, you know, the Word of God says that God is looking for those who worship him in spirit and in truth. And I just want to encourage each and every one of you to just spend time in God's presence. We're all busy with life, with, with jobs, with children. There's so much things that are trying to take up our time. But that's a ploy of the enemy. The ploy of the enemy is to make us so busy that we don't have time to spend in God's presence. The most important thing that you can ever do is make time. We have to put God number one in every area of our lives. Hallelujah. And I want to encourage each and every one of you, you know, as busy as you are in your lives, try to make time every day um, to just spend time on your knees, just you and God, just praising Him, just worshipping Him. You know, it, it, it's a relationship with your, with, with your Creator. You don't have to come to God with fancy prayers. And God just wants what's in your heart. He wants you to come just as you are. And I want to encourage you, you know, the Word of God says that if you draw near to Him, He will draw near to you. I want to encourage you, you know, that we're living in the last days. Time is very short. The day of the Lord is at hand. All the signs that are taking place are off the Richter scale, brothers and sisters. I mean, the way the Lord has been ministering to me in regards to His, uh, His imminent arrival is just so amazing, you know. He's really, really making it clear to His bride that there's no more time left. Um, so I just want to encourage you just to spend this, you know, as much time as you can in His presence. You know, the more time you spend in that secret place, just you and the Lord on your knees, on your face, just talking to Him. And if you don't know what to say to Him, I mean, for those of you who are baby Christians, you, you, it, it's your heart. It's, it's heart to heart with your Savior. It's you coming to Him as you are and just giving everything to Him. To just say, Lord, I love you. Lord, I praise you. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I honor you. Praise Him, worship Him, even in the midst of the storms that are coming at you, in the midst of the persecution, in the midst of the things, the trials and tribulations that you are going through in your life. Praise Him, worship Him, glorify Him. Hallelujah. And you will see your situation change. The enemy, Satan, hates nothing more than a true worshipper. He cannot stand true worshippers. In fact, he hates the very sound of praise and praise and worship. He flees the minute you start praising and worshipping. You know, when I'm going through certain things and, and the enemy's throwing things at me left, right and centre, all I know how to do is get on my knees because I understand that the battle is won on the knees. I don't call up a friend straight away and, and pour out of my heart what's been happening. and Because, you know, friends will, will give you the wrong advice. People will give you the wrong advice. I want to encourage you to, to always take everything to God first in prayer. Because the battle is won on the knees. We are in a battle. Every day we're in a battle. The true battle begins once you become saved. Once you become a born-again, spirit-filled Christian, once you become a Christian that is a threat to the devil's kingdom, a Christian on fire, hallelujah, then you're a threat to the kingdom of darkness. Let me tell you, and he will start throwing those darts at you left, right and center. <laughs> you know, and I mean, your family will come against you. People will come against you. Um... But I want to encourage you that you have the Word of God. The Word of God is a weapon against the enemy. It's the sword of the Spirit. This is why it's so important for Christians to meditate upon the Word of God daily. Don't just allow your pastors to teach you the Word of God. 
You need that time with the Lord in the Word of God, meditating on the Word of God, just as you need food for your body, so you also need food for your spirit. The Word of God is spiritual food for you. And the Word of God strengthens you, it heals you, it delivers you. The Word of God has turnaround power to turn around every situation in your life, brothers and sisters. So I want to encourage you today, join me um, for a few minutes and let's just give all the glory, the honor and praise to our King. Let's magnify His holy name together. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. For He is worthy to be praised. He is worthy to be glorified. And you know, yeah, sometimes you know, when you worship and praise, it's good to put on a little, little bit of music in the background, a little bit of praise and worship music. Whatever you feel, you know, I, I, I usually just tend to get on my knees and I, you can be the music, you know, I usually just sing to him and I just usually lift up his name. And I, and I tell you, when you get into that atmosphere of praise and worship, brothers and sisters, the atmosphere will change. Hallelujah. The atmosphere will change. The presence of God will enter the room. Hallelujah. You'll feel His presence. You know, you'll feel His peace that passes all understanding. It is real. It is real. It's not a peace that the world gives, but it's a peace that comes straight from heaven. It's purifying, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. So without further ado, I encourage you just get into position and just uh, let's just give all the glory and honor and praise to our precious Lord and Savior. And um, hallelujah. And I've just got a little a, a song here, Name Above All Names. Don't know if you can hear it very well. It's a name above all names. Hallelujah. It's the name above all names. And we will shout it to a dying world. Jesus, we love you, Lord. Who will declare my name? Who will shout my name in the middle of the nations? Who will take the shield of faith and the sword of my tongue? And declare my name to a dying world. I will, Lord. He who has declared me thus far, Jesus, will walk in even greater power. We glorify you, Lord. For the sands of time are running out. But my name will be declared in this final hour. I am Jehovah, I am that I am, and my trumpet shall soon call out. I form the world with just a whisper. But I'm getting ready, I'm getting ready, I'm getting ready to shout. Yes, Lord, hallelujah. It's the name above all names. Yes, Lord. And we will declare it. We will declare it. It's a name above all names And we will shout it to a dying world Glorify you, Lord I will possess my people Jesus, we love you And I'll take every inch So they surrender to me Hallelujah for I'm building an army, and I've given it my name, and my words, and your voice will set the captives free. Hallelujah. I am Jehovah. I am that I am. 
and my trumpet shall soon call out. I form the worlds with just a whisper, but I'm getting ready. I'm getting ready. I'm getting ready to shout. Yes, Lord. Oh, we glorify you. Glorify him, brothers and sisters. Lord, we magnify your holy name. You are worthy. Hallelujah. You are so holy. We bless the name of the Lord. All of the glory and the honor and the power and the praise belongs to you. Jesus, King of kings and Lord of lords. Oh, wonderful Saviour, no one is like you, Lord. Your name is the name that is above every other name. Oh, yes, we lift up your name and glorify you. Hallelujah. Your name is the name above every other name. Lord, all other gods are the works of man's hands, but you are the Most High God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Lord. Glorify you. We glorify you. We bless your holy name. We praise your holy name. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of my rock, who trains my hands for war. Yes, Lord, you train our hands for war. Hallelujah. You cause us to walk and we are overcome with power, Lord. Your Holy Ghost power. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Blessed be the Lamb who will open the scroll and loose the seven seals. Hallelujah. Proclaim these words to every land. Let my people prepare for war. Hallelujah. Wake up the mighty men. Let all the men become mighty men of war. Yes, it's time to declare that the coming of the Lord. He's coming at an hour that we think not. Hallelujah. Jesus. 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 Thank you for your presence, Lord. Oh, wonderful Jesus. We magnify you. Holy Lord, oh, we welcome your presence. Come, Holy Spirit, fill this room with your presence. Oh, Lord, I just pray for every individual person, Father God, that is joining in with this praise and worship. Lord, let your glory fall on them right now, Father God, wherever they, they are kneeling, wherever they are standing, Father God. Oh, let your presence enter that room, Lord. We pray for your presence, Father God, for your grace, for your peace, Father God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I just cancel every wicked plan of the enemy, Lord, every spiritual attack that is coming against the body of Christ. Lord, I destroy the work of the enemy right now in Jesus' name. I command every evil arrow that the enemy is sending to my brothers and sisters in Christ, every evil arrow. Hear the word of the Lord right now. Scatter by fire and go back to sender now in the name of Jesus. Lord, I cancel the wicked plan of the enemy, Father God, right now in Jesus' name. And Lord, I just lift up all my brothers and sisters in Christ, Father God, all over the world, Father God. We are all one body, Father God. And I pray, Father God, in this time that we are in, that you will strengthen each and every individual one of them, Father God. You know the struggles that they are going through, Father God. I pray that you will touch them, Lord, that you will heal them, Lord, that you will deliver them, Lord, that you will give them a spirit of perseverance, Father God. Hallelujah, for the joy of the Lord is their strength. Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters, just point your hand to the screen. The anointing of God is flowing so powerfully right now, and I'm just being led by the Holy Spirit. Point your hand to the screen. The Lord's going to touch you. Whatever need you are, lift it up to the Lord right now. 
in Jesus name the Lord said Katie Katie who is watching this he, he, he's got everything under control the Lord says Katie do not fear my daughter I'm with you I promised you Katie that I will never ever leave you or forsake you I'm with you always even unto the very end of the age hallelujah the Lord Jesus says just trust in him with all of your heart my dear darling daughter Katie lean not on your own understanding hallelujah Lord, touch every one of my brothers and sisters right now. I plead the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus, the blood of Jesus over you right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, I pray for your angels right now, Father God, to surround my brothers and sisters. Lord, let them feel the strong anointing, Father God. Many of you are, are feeling just the presence of God so strong right now and that you're you're beginning to cry. I just want to encourage you, for those of you who've never cried when you worship the Lord, it's not a bad thing, it's a good thing. Uh, when the Holy Spirit touches your heart, you, you, you cannot just keep still. When God touches you, especially in praise and worship, you can't keep still. Some of, sometimes you will cry, sometimes you will laugh, or sometimes you will shake uncontrollably. Jesus is touching you right now, brothers and sisters. He's touching you right now. Just receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. We are Tamaleo for Sunday. Let the fire and the power of the Holy Ghost consume everything, Lord, that is not of you right now. In Jesus' name, I break every chain and every band over everyone watching this video in Jesus name Lord anyone that is in bondage right now be broken be broken be broken Lord I nullify and render powerless and useless every attempt of the enemy to steal to steal the joy Father God of my brothers and sisters hallelujah every spirit of deception lies and confusion operating in these last days I cancel you I arrest you right now in Jesus name go back to the abyss where you belong never ever to return again Lord, I just pray right now, Father God, Lord, that you touch each and every one of your children that are watching this video, Father God. Lord, I just lift up their prayer request to you right now in Jesus' name, Father God. And I just pray, Father God, for your intervention, that you know what they're going through. Hallelujah. As individuals, Father God. Kababasiande. Brother David, Brother David, you're watching this. The Lord says, Son, I've got you. Son, I've got you. Do not fear. Do not worry. Do not worry. The situation is in control. For I am at work behind the scenes, says the Spirit of the Lord. Dear Brother David, the Lord says you've been waiting for something, you've been praying for something, and you've been questioning God. Lord, I don't understand. I'm doing everything that you've asked me to, but why is it? The Lord says, breakthrough is coming now, my son, David. The Lord says, thank you for your patience, my son. It is coming. It is coming. Hallelujah. It is on its way. The answer to your prayer, your breakthrough is on the way, dear Brother David. Shambaleo, sambaleo, si antai kalamasendo. Hey, re 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 shi kalamariondo. Rumareo sokobo si ande. And all of those who are struggling with sickness and disease, I want to encourage you right now that the healer, his name is Jesus. He is the great I am. He is the deliverer. He is the one that sets you free. I want to encourage you right now to point your hands to the screen. Receive your healing right now in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Lord, I pray for complete healing and restoration right now. Arthritis uh, in Lucy. Sister Lucy, you have arthritis in your back. You suffer debilitating pain. The Lord is healing you right now. Sister Lucy, receive your healing in Jesus' name. You're going to feel the fire of God touching your back right now in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. A tingling sensation in your back. Dr. Jesus is giving you instant surgery, Sister Lucy. Hallelujah. You are healed by his stripes. Sister Amanda. Amanda, you, you suffer with diabetes. 
Hallelujah. The Lord is completely healing you and restoring you right now. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Lift your hands up and receive it, Amanda. Oh, for whom the sun sets free is free indeed. Father, we magnify you. We glorify you, Lord. We honor your holy name. Blessing and honor and power and glory belongs to you. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way. Sister Katrina, Sister Katrina, the Lord just mentioned your name and he just showed me your neck and you've been having a lot of neck problems, a lot of neck pain. Hallelujah. The Lord says that he's healing you right now. You're going to feel just the presence, the fire of God around your neck. Receive it. Hallelujah. Sister Katrina, your neck problems, your neck pain, God is God is healing you right now, sister. Hallelujah. You've got tightened muscles in your neck and you've been haven't been able to turn to turn your neck properly. Sister Katrina, you are healed by his stripes. Receive it, receive it. Holy Ghost and fire, Holy Ghost and power. Holy Ghost and fire, Holy Ghost and power. Thank you, Father God, for deliverance that's taking place right now. Brothers and sisters, by faith, lift up your hands to this screen and the Lord is touching you right now. Whatever ailment you are suffering from, He's healing you right now. He's delivering you right now. It doesn't matter what you're going through. Cancer, sickness, disease, diabetes, arthritis, leg pain, whatever it is, muscle pain, He's healing you right now. Oh, Brother Roy. Roy, the Lord's shown me your jaw, your, your jaw, and you've had jaw problems. You've had a clicking sound in your jaw and a bit of jaw pain. Jaw pain. I'm seeing your jaw, your jaw, and there's a lot of jaw pain and clicking problems. Roy, brother Roy, the Lord is healing your jaw, your jaw right now. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Mary, sister Mary. Well, Lord is showing me your lungs. You've been diagnosed with lung cancer and you've got to go in for surgery on a Thursday. Hey, Araba, Seko, Lobo. Hey, hey, hey. Le send Arabosio. Sister Mary, you will not be having surgery. Sister Mary, the Lord is healing you right now of lung cancer. The Lord is delivering you right now. In Jesus' name, receive your healing, Sister Mary. Lord, I speak to Mary's lungs right now in Jesus' name. Sister Mary's lungs be restored right now by the fire and the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Father God, that when Mary goes in for surgery, Father, when Mary goes in for her x-ray, Father God, Lord, they will find no trace of the cancer because you did it, Lord. You said it, Father God, and your will, your word will not return void, but it will accomplish a thing which you set it to accomplish in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, you said, Father God, that we will lay our hands on the sick and they will be healed, Father God. You've given us authority as your children, Father God, to intercede for the sick, to lay our hands on them, to cast out demons, Father God. Hallelujah. You said, Father God, that we would do greater works, Lord Jesus, because you go to God the Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father God, for your touching every individual person right now in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I plead the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Lord, over each and every one of them. Sandy, Sister Sandy, you have knee problems. The Lord is healing you right now of your knee of your knees you have to get um, reconstructive surgery on your knees but sister sandy hallelujah be encouraged the lord is touching you right now receive your healing sister receive your healing the lord is giving you brand new knees right now